Thousands of runners were trying to go the distance this morning in the First Light Marathon. Sponsored by Service First Bank, it's been a big event in Mobile for 15 years now. There can only be one to finish first, but as Chad Petrie shows us, the race had a lot of winners. They march through Midtown. Morning, woo, way to go! Cheered on as they make their way to the end of the journey. I love running. A simple answer. So it clears my mind and it's uh, something I'm passionate about. It does such a good job clearing the mind. Oh, yeah. Appreciate it. Brandon nearly forgot his medal for finishing the half marathon. Oh. Whooped and hot, even though it's cold out here. I don't know, man. It's nicer to run in the cold weather mm -hmm. than it is in the hot. It is a particularly cold day for a marathon in Mobile, and you know the runners aren't feeling it, but surprisingly, the people on this side of the barricade watching it aren't feeling the cold either. Oh, I'm not cold. This is exciting. I've got a lot of my kids that I work with out here with Team Triumph, and it's just the best thing in the world. Yeah, looking good, looking good. Team Triumph is a nonprofit group taking kids and adults with special needs on long races. Tired. It was awesome though. Weather was great. Grace did fantastic. We were with her good friend for the first 10 miles and she said, Go! I said, You're the boss. And with 2,000 runners, everyone had a different experience. I feel like it was great. It was my first half marathon race. It's much warmer weather here in Alabama relative to Washington, so it was perfect running weather for me, even if it was kind of a chilly day for Alabama. In Mobile, Chad Petrie, News 5.